Hey buddy, it's Invicta. It's time to the run here. The Binding of Isaac Victor Repentance Series. Happy Tuesday, Mosh Pit. Thank you all very much for all the support. We did have another video crossing 3,000 likes, and I'm proud to announce the next like streak goal. Now that the ultimate item tier list is done, we have at 150 the worst ranked tier list items run. I'll talk about that in a moment, as well as read the responses of the day from last Tuesday's episode. But first, here's your artwork of the day submitted by Paradoxes Black on the Sinvicta Discord. Uh, there was no thread, it was just art, and I really love it. So go check out the full resolution if you are on the Mosh Pit Discord. Thank you to Paradoxes Black. Absolutely love all the little quotes. It's a little bit difficult to read on this device uh, wherever you're watching, even if you're on the computer, but I do love the uh, the Hulk Hogan mustache on Worm Buddy. Ooh, yeah, brother! Thank you very much, Paradoxes Black. My voice is still kind of kind of hoarse from uh, the tier list. So let's hop on in. We'll talk about the new Like Street goal, everybody. Again, thank you very much for all the support over the weekend. Oh my gosh, look at our tears rate. CJ is going to be 6 8 Yankee X ray, Whiskey Whiskey Alpha Mike. We've got, uh, oh, there's Endless Nameless. Uh, we've got the the tractor beam along with the with mom's box, which, you know, it's that's not a bad starting item. We've got good damage, fantastic tears. This is the one of the highest tears rate I think I've ever seen at a base level uh, on the start of an Eden run without like soy milk or, you know, something that's modifying it. So this is just our base stats. Plus, uh, well, I take that back. It, it's our base stats plus whatever um, whatever uh, Tractor Beam is. It's But Tractor Beam isn't really that significant of a tiers upgrade. So uh, there's Spider Mod, uh, which, you know, that would give us two or three for Spider Babby already. But it doesn't really matter. I mean, Spider Spider Babby is okay, I suppose. Uh, but talking about the new Light Street goal really quickly here, um, uh, the worst, now again, now, now the Ultimate Isaac tier list uh, video is done. And the stream has uh, concluded. Those of you who have not seen it yet, definitely go check it out. And thank you very much for those of you who did come out live. Um, but but what I will say now that it's done is uh, I figured why not torture myself even more and let's get a custom run where it's literally only the items that I ranked at the bottom. Not TM Trainer, by the way, because I think because TM Trainer, would just there's no point of that. So every single worst ranked item that I put on the tier list will be the only items that will show up on that run and uh i'm just probably going to go in the order that uh, i put them on the on the tier list just because there was uh, there was no rhyme or reason to it it was just totally random um so yeah so now i am gonna have to use the console command for that so i won't be doing it on the youtube uh save file but i will be doing it on the on the uh twitch save file so i can just give myself items and that sort of stuff and it should be a lot of fun and it's something that a lot of people were kind of hoping to see and i was already planning on doing that just because i like to troll myself and you know people like seeing me kind of suffer and everything like that but uh but yeah you know i think that the what, surprisingly um it took us it did take us three hours to do which was a little bit longer than i was anticipating or hoping it would uh but at the same time you know the mosh pit was it was it was phenomenal to see the response in chat wasn't really a whole lot of arguing, wasn't really a whole lot of disagreeing. A lot of people were definitely on board, more so than any other tier list that I've done uh, for a while, which is good. I mean, I don't want everyone to agree with me, obviously, but it is kind of nice whenever chat's not bickering back and forth with each other or trying to influence, like, you know, here and there. Now, what I will say is that I couldn't read the chat the entire time, obviously, because I just... I, I did not want to spend a minute on every single item because that would take forever. I mean, we ranked over 900 items almost, so it was rough. And yeah, we were missing some of the some of the item icons. I didn't, I wasn't anticipating that, but what can you do? It's Steven, which is going to be a nice damage up for us. And uh, safety scissors are not bad, but I think I'm going to take the telescope lens, which is going to give us a a much higher increased chance uh, for the planetariums. And I'm going to go back here and use this uh, dime that we found to reroll a box of spiders to maybe get ourselves some movement speed. We could definitely use it. Some damage would be nice. More HP would be good. Cape boat is not good. Neither is Dunce Cap. Well, Dunce Cap plus. Dunce Cap plus. Uh, I guess it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Never mind. I was going to say Dunce Cap plus Tractor Beam. It could be kind of pog, but it's not. Um, there was not a bomb. Was there a bomb in the store? I don't think so. Uh, but it does give us spectral tears, I think, which is good. There was a bomb. Uh, I'm going to go to this tinted rock because it's the first tinted rock that we saw. And we got a soul heart out of it. I'll take it. So, yeah. So, we got some good use out of that dime and gave us 
uh, Dunce Cap, which didn't technically even do anything for us, but we also got a bomb, which did give us a soul heart, and now we have a an increased chance of a planetarium. It's, it's actually worth it for us to finish this floor because we might find another bomb. That could be kind of good. You know what? We are shooting two tiers. I can tell. I can tell me. Wow, there's another tender rock here. I can tell immediately by our damage we are actually shooting two tiers in one. So I take that back. Dunce Cap is working as I was hoping it would. Um, and the reason why I can tell by that is just because just look at I mean, we're one shotting. And if you look really, really carefully, you can see two. You can see a double impact right there. So yeah, that, that's I, I was going to be disappointed if they nerfed that. I'm glad that they didn't. Um, Dunce Cap plus uh, plus tractor beam is phenomenal, just like any other multi shot with it. Going over the responses, the most upvoted responses that we had. Oh my gosh, look at the chunkage. The most upvoted responses that we had from last week's episode, the Rock Bottom episode. Um, I asked people, uh, what is, is is Rock Bottom the most broken item in Isaac? And there was a lot of responses, lots of debating going on. I love the discussion. And again, thank you everyone who's been uh, on board with the with the with the engagement train. I really do, really really do strongly and uh, wholeheartedly appreciate everyone out there making an effort and growing the channel it's been making it's it's been making a difference and i, I can't thank you enough so that being said um the the up the most upvoted comment as of today was from nikolai uh, whose last name i can't read so i'm not gonna hopefully offend them um but they said it helps you become broken and i actually really really do agree with this comment um it does help you become broken it's sort of like a think of it like a broken enabler it's a broken run enabler right um, it's not inherently good on its own because it just doesn't do anything on its own. But the potential there is is unmatched in terms of Isaac power, in terms of overall strength of of a run. It, rock bottom can't be beat um, because it it successfully negates any bad effects. I mean, it's just it, it's just going to make your run huge. It's going to make your run phenomenally strong. Um, and then uh, Wyatt Sipes also said yes, but only if you get other items in the right order. Again, kind of along the same lines there. It's just a it's a broken enabler, um, and Rock Bottom is you know I think is consistently considered to be one of if not the strongest items in all of Isaac. But I will say again, on its own, it does nothing. Um, it's it's it is wholly dependent on what you get uh, for your seed. But if you get the right stuff, as we've al as we've always seen, in almost every single case, rock bottom is just an absolute banger of an item, and uh, you know it's it's just it's just good. It's almost too good, um, which is hilarious because of you know the other nerfs that we get for items that aren't very good. But you know. That's neither here nor there, I guess. Um, another upvoted comment here was from Brainstorms, who just said, most broken item is just, hey, you brainstorms. And then finally, uh, someone else, uh, Destiny, Destiny, uh, Destiny is still uh, 5910 said, the most broken item is TM Trainer Lol. And that is also true if we're talking about in the most literal sense. Um, but, you know, overall, I think that Rock Bottom is without question... When it's popping off, there, there's just no comparison. It, you, you can't even come close. Should be getting a planetarium here pretty soon. We'll happily black room cane, and we get a tears up and a uh, range up as well. So, which is just exponentially more useful and better than cane. Wouldn't mind getting options, of course, if we do end up getting a bomb. Uh, we can bomb the donation machine. Uh, you have to get, forgive my voice here. I'm, I'm, it's the two, it's the two days, two days away from from recording. We can do this. That's, the multi hits really helping us out. That's not though, but um, and uh, my voice is it's it, it's almost back to full strength, but I am I am kind of hurting a little bit. The quality here. Seeing here, lack of movement speed is definitely a problem. 
but we're making it. Steven, well, Steven looks like he's sticking his tongue out. He looks like Lick a Tongue. Am I the only one who sees that? Kind of looks like Lick a Tongue out there <coughs> on Isaac's head. Of course, that's from Super Bandage. Super Bandage was a great get for us. And there is our requisite planetarium. Don't know how we got hit by that globin. Diamond. Jupiter and Saturnus. Our movement speed's already, like, the bottom of the bin Garbo, so... We don't have a reason to lower it anymore. If we needed HP, then yes, but we don't. I would love to get options if possible. You know the secret room's north of here, but we just don't have any bombs. More scent, we can get options. We got a bomb. Uh, I'm gonna take a risk and go into the secret room here. This is a risk because we could just use it to get options, but I'm hoping that there's money in here or extra bombs. And this will also enable us to get a boosted rate of either the planetarium or uh, angel room or devil deal. And now we can go back and pick up options before our next item room, which is really good. Not the way to the Tienda. Where's our Tienda? Down here? Yep. Got a couple keys. You know what? I'm not going to hate on that. So what we're really, really, really hoping for right now is going to be... You know what? Can I, we're, we're not done yet here. Hang on. Hang on now. <clears throat> what we really, really, really want here is going to be a devil deal so we can get rid of this red heart and so we can go into the uh, and so we can go into the bedroom and get three soul hearts back. It's essentially a free devil deal item if we get a devil deal. Now, why did I take Callus? Well, I'll show you in just a moment. We can go back. Remember that chest, that golden chest that's above this, that's behind spikes? We can go back there and actually get that without having to worry about taking damage, which you never know. It could be pretty huge. Horn photo is going to give us more tears and shot speed, which is good. I'm not I'm not going to complain about that, although I would like to see a little bit of damage. Um, yeah, this room right here. And we got keys. So what I was really hoping for is that we were going to get uh, a devil deal so we can so we can make use of the bedroom up there, but it's not going to happen. Um, it's a dirty room, so there's going to be no crawl space in there. I know that the super secret room is south of here, but oh well. Not even going to debate what we do in here. This would have been a much better room to use the Ace of Diamonds in. But you're seeing here this this layered effect of us using of us using our uh, our double tiers thanks to the Wiz. I mean, it, it does so much more damage. We're, we are essentially dealing double damage, and that's huge, um, especially when we don't have a lot of base damage to begin with. My V bag here. But boy, howdy, do we need some movement speed? <laughs> we're, we're we're slower than we're slower than molasses on a cold day right now. It's 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 just almost an instant one shot of low level low level uh, enemies, and we get Capricorn, which is going to give us an increased tears cap along with just everything else. So that is really nice, and it does also give force give us the movement speed. And this is the wrong one. More keys. I'm liking this. So even though we're going in the wrong direction here, we're still getting... We're, we're making gains. Uh, and us getting Capricorn, I'm going to attribute that to us also getting uh, more options on the previous floor. 
So that was well worth the time investment to go finish out that 15 cents and uh, allow us to acquire one of the best items in the game. Overall tiers, overall damage. I mean, it's just, it's so good. We'll take Charge Baby just because Charge Baby can help us out and uh, get a couple of extra charges on our active item. It can also freeze everything, like stun everything. I would have really loved to have seen the compass, however, because that would have told me whether or not we have a planetarium. Penny is cursed bad. And will we have to wait till floor five for our deal with the devil or deal with the angel? The answer is... No. Magic 8-Ball, that's going to increase the amount of... Uh, Planetarium chance even more. We get credit card, which is not going to help us with this. I am going to take the Dark Prince's Crown because this does give us an all stats up here, basically. Uh, and also destroys, destroys our tears cap. So as long as we maintain a single red heart, we are able to deal an increased amount of DPS. Now, if you're wondering what I'm going back for, it's because we have a chance of getting another planetarium, which would be nice. Um, we got a shot off of that. Definitely one that I would say that Neptunus would be pretty good for. Um, Uranus, of course, would be amazing. Um, if we could somehow get, uh, you know, if we could somehow get Terra, that would be nice. Even Soul would be okay. Bob's cursing two Soul Hearts here. You can keep that key. The key is on the house. Special tiers given to us by the Wiz, also of course, hugely, hugely beneficial. Um, so. We have, the, we have the credit card, so we could have used it on the Devil Deal, but I chose not to uh, because I wanted to activate Dark Prince's Crown. It's not every single day that you get a pretty big boost out of it, and it's absolutely worth it, in my opinion. Here, anyway. So, we have eight bombs. Uh, Super Secret Room is probably here. Okay. We see there that the... The uh, Dark Prince's Crown did run out because obviously we got rid of our Red Heart. And a Devil card is not what we want, so. Yeah, looking forward to seeing what the reaction is now that people know what the new like streak is. Like streak goal, I should say, is. I have a feeling that it's going to be very popular. Um, and, uh, you know, can we win with what I consider to be the worst items in Isaac? Or maybe not worst, but my least favorite. I don't know. There's no room there. Very strange. Okay. What was that game? Wow. Okay. All right. Leapers taking their schmoovin' pills today. So we should have a huge chance of getting a planetarium here. With Mom's box, along with the telescope lens, along with us just getting the magic eight ball, uh, it, we should be almost, I would say, guaranteed another planetarium. I am going to bomb for more options here. And yeah, I didn't want that. I was really hoping that we were just going to be able to buy options, but uh, we may have to use a credit card for that. Although it's way, way, way more important that we use this for a devil deal. If we do happen to get one, we are going to have to backtrack for the shop. Uh, our damage is not our damage is not phenomenal our DPS is good though do your growth hormone which is great and yep yeah. Yoki. so we are going to take the credit card and use it in here yeah. buy everything poker chip all this stuff um Let's go look for the planetarium real quick. We don't have to be holding on to the telescope lens to proc or to spawn the uh, planetarium. Charge baby. 
have just a little bit of time that we can maybe, maybe, maybe find to get boss rush. We were able to, we were able to completely stonewall uh, Chubb there. Maybe didn't have anything to freeze. This looks like there was something that spawned up to the north here. I have a feeling there might be a planetarium over here. Is it? Just gas. It's all right. Happens to the best of us. The only reason why I'm doing this is because, well, on top of looking for a planetarium is because we also have a lot of bombs. And these bombs will allow us to traverse through depths two a lot faster, uh, so we can make boss rush. But we can't we can't be dilly dallying too much longer here? And most of the time, planetariums I would say are not really worth looking for. And this has now become like sort of too out of our way for for this to have been worth it. And it's just nothing. All right. Alrighty. So now we've got to get a move on. And I don't know if we're going to make boss rush at this point. It's, I was not, I was not planning on doing this much exploration. I thought that we were going to be in and out at like 16 and a half minutes, but that, uh, that did not happen. We got to hurry. Dead end. So we know exactly where we don't need to be. And any rooms like this that's just going to take a while to uh, to clear, we're just going to get, we're just going to blow right through. Although I need to see if our if our fool card was in there. I don't actually know. Specs. cars in here but this time it's not and do I wish we had flying right now Car was actually right outside of mom's fight of mom's room. Um, not too happy with how the search for this went, especially taking really, really dumb damage while I was looking at the map on those spikes. The only way this is worth it is if is if boss rush has phenomenal items and it probably doesn't. A mega troll bomb. Ah. Uh, don't know what hit me there, but I'm going to take the Polaroid. Wow, this is a unique situation. Man, this is... Inner Eye gives us so many shots. Man, it kills our tears rate, though. I got to go ease mascara, but it's a tough, tough sell on that. Because having the having five shots in one is pretty incredible. But when it comes down to it, we're already dealing a lot of damage with two shots. And imagine if we just deal more damage with those shots. 
So this was a greed fight, so we know that our shop is good. I'd like to get that soul heart back. Foolishly lost. Got plenty of bombs, so I am going to see if we can maybe get some soul hearts out of this. Ghost baby. First justice card. Okay. Okay. We have that we have that ghost baby there. Now we use the reverse justice card inside of the secret room. Um good things can happen. If we get an item. Got one of. We do really need the soul heart, but at the same time. We're gonna we're gonna go for the gusto here. Uh, it does not roll shop items, so we don't have to worry about that. So no... Wow, we got tech zero for, for uh, Ghost Baby. Also, I didn't realize that no with Mom's... Uh, Mom's box, it prevents quality zero items from spawning. Did you know that? Because I didn't. We get tech zero, which is just huge. And we get Orphan Socks, which gives us spike immunity. Very funny game. Thank you for listening to me. And uh, movement speed, which is great. <clears throat> so very big time play there with that, uh, with the reroll. Yeah, we don't have to worry about spikes anymore. How about that? Ain't that neat? Get a Yara here. Card reading is very good. Uh, BFF doesn't really matter, but we'll take it anyway. Could go Yara. I'm going to hold on to the Yara rune until I see what's inside of our mob trap or our um, uh, super secret room. And there's not really a whole lot. Okay. Boros Worm. Oh, my sweet lord. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll try that. I'm down with it. I can smell what you're cooking. Um, sure. Sure, let's go with that. Yeah. Ouroboros Worm plus, plus Tractor Beam. My goodness. Uh, I'm going to use Ansa's Rune since we didn't get the Red Portal. Wow, that is... I want to see if this is actually dealing damage or if it's not. Four Soul Hearts for nothing here. It's not Buttless Chub. That is a Butt Chub. Temperance Machine, which we don't really want. Oh my gosh. This is... Weird. Weird in a good way. I mean, we're... It's just melting everything. Um, and of course, it's being influenced heavily by uh, my mom's box. It means that we get a huge tears up and shot speed up as well. Imagine if we had piercing. If we had piercing, it, it would just be over. I mean, it's just, it's a constant beam of damage, essentially. It was here. Yeah, couple keys. I do like our, I like our little routine that we're kind of getting into now, you know, with the questions, the, the, the engagements of the day, the questions of the day, people have really been latching onto the idea and, and supporting the channel. And, you know, I, I cannot thank you enough. Mama Gertie, what the hell? Okay. That's something you see all that often. Um, but it, it, the response has been, has been great. And uh, again, like I said, it's, it, it is, it's really shown uh, in the growth of the channel. Um, these last couple of weeks have been have just been doing gangbusters for us. 
lots of new subscribers, lots of new people coming out of the woodwork, and uh, you know, and subscribe, and like I said, subscribing and just being a, a phenomenal source of support. And I thank you all very much, as well as welcome new subscribers. Hopefully, you're enjoying your time here. And that will be today's question of the day, which is going to be: Are you a new subscriber? If you're not a new subscriber, then can you find out when you subscribed? I think it is possible. There are, there are ways to do that. I'm just curious. Of course, remember the top three upvoted answers will be read on next Tuesday's episode. Stay tuned for that. Like I said, I like this sort of routine that we got. It, it, it's, it's developing, right? Like we're still... So kind of feeling out the process, trying to figure out, like, you know, what, what the flow is going to be. Are we going to, you know, ju just basically what is the right time for me to talk about the, the question of the day and, and read them? I like reading them at the start of the episode because a lot of people are looking forward to hearing their responses. Um, at, the, at the same time, I like to also ask at the end of the episode because it keeps people, uh, you know, it keeps people interested and engaged in, in watching the entire run and, uh, you know, moving around. Moving around when I actually call for it um, is uh, is also going to be it's a little bit of a little, little bit of a strategy there. But yeah, if you're a new subscriber or are you a new subscriber, let me know in the comments down below on the pinned comment. Hopefully, it's there. Sometimes YouTube doesn't publish my comments, and I have to go back and actually retype them. Full hard back, thanks to Bike Rock. Mom's key is just doing doing work for us here. Really wish we had piercing shots though. I dropped has really made this gear effect really, really funky. A devil deal. I am gonna go into hush though. This is a strategical hush visit. Because I want to see if we can get some use out of the uh, out of the store. Plus, we also have the red portal. Hopefully, oh my goodness! Well, we got ease mascara, and now we have polyphemus. It's going to be absolutely atrocious for our tears and shot speed. But uh, what does this look like without Orboro Swarm? Don't know if that's good or not. Remember, we're also being influenced by uh, being influenced by Dark Prince's crown. So, and this was a big old no go. Well, let's see how this goes. Just, a, just imagine if we had Pearson, man. Imagine if we had rock bottom. This is what the pseudo piercing looks like. You're seeing what Tech Zero would do if it had piercing. Use the reverse uh, chariot card here. Oh, come on, Hush. You gotta do us like that, huh? All right. 
lost a little bit more HP than I'm happy with there, but what can you do? His old hush after all. Uh, we don't really need Voodoo. Voodoo Head anymore is not going to do anything for us. Checking for Tinted Rocks really quickly. We can also check for a secret room. We have 46 bombs, so we could also also check for a crawl space. Maybe that has a black market in it. No secret room. It's off the shop, which if it is, I'm not really going to look for it. I don't really care that much, to be honest. Hey, look at that. Get Loki's horns, which is actually pretty incredible for Tractor Beam and Ouroboros Worm and Tech Zero because now, <coughs> uh, well, I mean, just look at the screen. <laughs> very goofy, wacky run. We do get a red portal, which I do appreciate. Card reading, thank you very much. Here, my voice is getting worse by the worse by the minute. Looking forward to resting it. I got. I actually have a little bit of a uh, green tea. I'm not a big tea fan, but uh, every now and then, you know, I haven't. I haven't been sick for a very long time, but green tea was absolutely banger um, with a little bit of lemon in it. Oof. And we do get a red portal, so wow. Hard reading, let me off the hook here on a Tuesday. We do not want proptosis. Um, and we got two hearts from it. Of course we did, so. Oh, wow. What a run, everyone. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you click that like button. Don't forget about the question of the episode, of course. And uh, it just simply ask, are you a new sub? And if you're not a new sub, then when did you sub? Um, I am actually a little bit curious. Before we wrap it up here, I'm going to go back and, and I just want to see what our damage with Proptosis would be. If we could actually, like... If we could actually make it work with Proptosis and this much shot speed. The Apple, which is not going to do anything for our tears rate, because we are absolutely capped. Oh my God. <laughs> Loki's horns, when it pops off with this with this Ouroboros Tech Zero combo we've got is uh, absolutely hilarious. And the tears are moving so fast that like the game does the game's having a problem registering the damage. I just want to see what our damage would be like with Proptosis. It, it didn't increase it a whole lot. Oh my god, yeah, that's... That is a lot more damage. That is one-shotting things. So, in this case, because our... Even though... Even though this is not a usual type of damage that we've got here. A usual run, I should say. Because our shot speed is so high, the negative coefficient on the proptosis scaling isn't even it's not even applying like we are doing as much damage look at that we literally one shot ragman there uh we're doing as much damage as we would be if we were standing up close and that is quite amazing so wow <laughs> yeah that's uh that's real good so thank you for watching everyone like i said if you did enjoy this episode, make sure you click that button. Leave a comment down below. I hope you had a great start to your Tuesday. I'm going to go rest my voice, go drink some of that tea I was just talking about. And as always, I will see you all next time. Until then, so long, everybody. Thanks for watching this video. I'd like to thank some patrons of mine like Mac, Crypto14, and Relat01. If you'd like to have your name read at the end of an Isaac episode or get your hands on one of those exclusive Synvicta keychains, then go check out my Patreon campaign, which you can find over at Patreon.com. Flash Invicta. 